A runaway ride creating a panic on a Texas football field. The chaotic scene caught on camera after a high school football game in Dallas as the winning team's coach gave his postgame interview, but the out of control cart brought the questions to a quick end. Oh my. An electric cart out of control with no one behind the wheel careening from the end zone at Cowboy Stadium Saturday night. The cart barreling into several people during the state high school championship football game. That's like a runaway cart there. It happened after a game between a Houston area high school and a San Antonio area high school. The coach of the winning team, Willie Amendola, taking the brunt of the impact while doing a TV interview. I mean, I had no clue what was going on until I found myself looking up at the ceiling of uh... Cowboy Stadium. I didn't know what it was. I mean, the back and then kind of landed in the passenger seat. The coach hitting his head on the seat. I don't know how fast it was going. It was going a pretty good clip. Another man on the ground, dangerously close to the careening cart. Amendola says he tried to grab the wheel. Kind of try to get it away from him. But it kept going for 10 more yards. Finally, when it was going, I just decided, man, I can't control this thing. It's going to the wall. And I just kind of got over there and rolled out as quick as I can so I can get run over by the thing. The whole thing lasting about five seconds until another man jumped in and shut it down. According to the Arlington Fire Department, a sideline marker from the field was tossed into the cart and may have lodged between the floorboard and the accelerator. Amendola says he can see the humor in it, but with his lower back, shoulder, and his hips still hurting him, he admits he's a little ticked off. It'd be, it'd be nice if somebody would call and just kind of offer an explanation. I laugh about it because it's kind of quite unusual, but it, I feel really bad for the people involved. It, it's uh, uh, unfortunate for sure. Well, in all, seven people suffered injuries. The good news, all those injuries were minor.